All right, we're starting something new today. We are going to use shading, um, to be specific, uh, chiaroscuro. You're going to use value to turn these different shapes into three-dimensional objects. So to get started on this, you're going to get, this is the end pro product. I'm gonna give you guys a piece of newsprint. I want you to fold it in half. I guess you would call this hot dog the long way fold it in half this one you're going to we're trying to make it six equal parts okay so without having to draw the lines I'm gonna have you guys just fold your papers okay something like that and you can open it up and you should have six different spaces all right you're gonna get a packet to share on your table you're going to go step by step. This is the beginning of drawing your cube. I want you to go two inches here, two inches here. Okay, you're going to begin with two, two, and a straight line. Okay, a vertical line. From there, from these one, two, three lines. One, two, I'm sorry, one, two, three. You're going to come back over here draw another vertical and another vertical and then you're going to do a line in the back right here okay that's really just showing you where it's connected um, from there you're going to do the top piece okay once we have this completed um, cube we're going to shade we're going to have the light source if we're thinking of the sun or the um, light bulb hitting right here it's going to be the lightest shade you're gonna have a little bit darker here a little bit darker on this side and your cast shadow of course will be the darkest so that will be step one here step two let's see I'm, I'm in reverse order you can do the cylinder if you would like to. Um, I've got this one at about two and a half here going across and about three and a half up here. Okay, so you do this cross here, come back. You just do step by step. It should be fairly easy. One thing you want to make sure you include is these lines here. This is going to be where you're gonna shade. This is what we talked about being the highlight. This here and this here will be the light. This will be your shadow. This will be the reflected light on that edge. And your cast shadow. So what I would like for you guys to do is step by step go through draw your shapes you can go ahead and get started with just these before you begin shading okay so there's your your cone there's your pyramid and this is i can't think of what it's called right now um it's not an octagonal you'll have to help me okay hexagon all right good luck <laughs> 